Hey Trace, this is Max. I uh, just want to uh, go over this with you. When you first log in with the login credentials that I give you, you're going to see this. This is called the dashboard. Okay. Now you can style this any way you want it. Uh, you know, you could drag and drop these things around. You could get rid of them. Uh, you know, if you're not going to use them or whatever. You know, maybe you just don't want to see it. The other thing is, you go up here to screen options. Like, let's say that we didn't want to see this WordPress blog here. We're not interested. We go up here, untick WordPress blog, and you see it disappears. And other WordPress news. Say we want to get rid of that. Just untick that box, and that stuff will disappear. Okay? Um, your pages. <clears throat> now, all your pages, if you go to your website right now, this is the way it looks. Okay? And we see that there's a sample page right here. And so we click on that sample page, let it come up, and this is what it kind of looks like. Okay? So you, they just have that in there so you could go through uh, your pages here. You see sample page. This is the back end, of course, in your dashboard. And you can edit it around. You could change the name, change the URL link, uh, and then, you know, add some content in there, uh, whatever you want. Uh, be sure and try to set a featured image with uh, the stuff. And then you can drag and drop files from your computer onto here. Uh, let me see if I can find a photograph that I could use. Oh, let's see here. I always like to use ones of my kids, so I drag and drop. So you drag and drop that, and that's how you upload a photo. And let's say that this was a 1997 Chevy Corvette. That's what you'd enter in here: 1997 Chevy Corvette. And then make sure that you not only enter in the title tag, but the alt tag as well, and click Set as Featured Image. And then, of course, you'd want to put a bunch of stuff in here as well now the other cool thing that you could do about this is you know after you add stuff to your media you can always add more pictures like let's say that uh, we want to go our media library now and that picture that we just had we can see it right here we can add it in there as well okay and then you can add several more pictures okay uh, if you, let's say you want to change the color of the text or something like that, or maybe you want to make it bold or italics, just highlight the text that you want. This is just like Microsoft Editor. You can make it bold, italics, you know, even have these crazy things where you can put a stripe through on it, or make it a bullet list, you know, or a numbered list. Okay? If you wanted to link this text, you can click this little link and then just type in a link like a, a one website pro dot com and just click add link and you'll see that this now becomes a link okay uh, this toggle is just that lower half of this bar so you'll be able to do that you know work that just fine and when you're ready to publish there'll be a little thing over here this one says update because it's already been published but if you want to update it you could just click update and then go back to your sample page and you'll refresh this okay and you should see the changes in there as soon as it gets us, gets done refreshing, and we can see that the changes are taking place, and you know, you can see the different things that you've done. See, here's that link, link page, the link you made, the other picture that you had on there. So this would be your featured image, and then th this would be the image that you had inside your uh, page there. So there's a lot of things in here to experiment around with. Uh, you know, like changing the color of the text, maybe you want it red. Uh, if you're going to paste something from plain text, you would use this and then uh, just paste the text inside this little box that appears. Or if you're, if you write something up on Microsoft Office or Microsoft Word, you'd use this, just paste it in there so you don't get all that extra code that comes with Microsoft Office. Uh, if you want to remove the formatting, you could do that. Or insert a custom character like a copyright or trademark symbol. You can uh, enter that in as, there as well. Uh, once you do, just click this box, and uh, maybe we want uh, copyright. Okay, so you see, it puts this little C in there, a little copyright image. Uh, if you're uh, in somewhere where you want to indent something, you could indent it like this or outdent. This is just to undo what you did last or redo what you did last, and uh, you just go down through here. Uh, you could uh, change the format of the uh, text. You know, just by having these different, you see that's an address. This would be a paragraph. But you could just don't be afraid to 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 mess around here for a little bit, just so you get used to the system. 
And then uh, once you get used to the system, then uh, you know, and you make your different pages, you can go on to making your posts. So uh, let me just go ahead and update this, and we'll go on to the post, and I'll click Add New here. And here you would give a title like, uh, you know, pickup truck, pickup truck. 2003, I uh, like Chevy's. So, and maybe if I learn how to spell truck. Now you'll notice something happens whenever I click down here. Pretty soon you'll get a link that shows up here. See it right here? That's good SEO. You want to have the link in in your. That'll be the link in the URL. And then this is your description. And just like the page, you see you have featured image. You can add tags, add categories. Maybe you want this to be trucks. Okay. Now this is only if you're going to be writing about a subject. This ain't. This isn't the actual listings. These, these are your posts, like your newsletters that go out. Okay. And then over here is your categories and the different tags that you use. Here's media. Let's say that you wanted to add a bunch of media at one time. You just go to your library here. Here, I'll just go ahead and leave this page. Just go to your library, you click Add New, and let's say that you wanted a bunch of uh, images at one time. I'll wait till this comes up here. You just select all the images, like from a folder, drag and drop all of them, and you'll see that they all upload one at a time, just like that. Then that way they're easily, readily available for future use. Okay. Uh, these are different comments. Like as you come through on your site, you'll see that there will be comments made. Uh, you can unapprove them, spam them, or just trash them like this, and then get rid of them like that. Now here is the cars for sale. Okay, so what you would do is you would click Add New, and basically just fill in the blanks. You know, it's laid out the same way as the post and the pages. You just put the title of the vehicle, the picture by clicking Add Media, and then you'll see you have your little box here. Uh, the location. You can say Boardman, uh, Niles, Warren, whatever. Um, <clears throat> there's a be a photo ribbon. You can uh, make a photo ribbon, set a featured image, and then here you put the VIN number, the stock number, you know, and then you know have the safety features, uh, convenience, uh, the comfort, entertainment, so on and so forth. So, and you can choose to to hide the tabs on vehicle page or not. And then you would click publish. So that's pretty much it. Uh, you would have uh, you have your different locations here. You, like if you wanted to add, we have Boardman, Ohio, and Youngstown, Ohio. I added them earlier, but you could add more right here. Like if you want to add Niles, just put Niles. So this would be all lowercase, just like that. And then cars for sale in Niles, Ohio. And then right down here at the bottom, just add new tag. Okay, so yeah, it's pretty easy, and uh, should have be able to add content without having to know any code. If you have any questions, this is enough to get you started. But uh, if you have any questions, comments, or concerns, don't hesitate to email me. Thanks, bud.